PhD. And this time last year, I began this presentation by talking about the economic engines that are up at Town Center, which we know about, uh, Town Center Mall, KSU, McCollum Field. There's millions of square feet of office. There is a Kennesaw Mountain Park. New job announcements, expansions and relocations. I'm happy to report this year that nothing has changed. We have the same economic engines, the same robust, diverse economy up there, and we're happy to announce uh, more job expansion, more expansions and more new job relocations. Um, so we're proud that uh, the Town Center CID is still one of the most active and diverse in the entire state. Tonight I want to give you a couple of statistics about the CID and some highlights about our accomplishments and our achievements in 2012. I'll look ahead to 13 and talk a moment about uh, CID management. Some statistics, Tad mentioned a few. We're the second oldest CID in, in uh, Georgia, established in 97. We are now in our third six-year term with a current life extended through 2015. Um, we're a walkable business community with more than 40 miles of sidewalks throughout the district. We're 250 commercial property owners. You know, as Tad mentioned, for 2012, we expect to collect approximately $3 million, roughly half the revenue of Cumberland, um, a revenue from our members within our district, and that is based upon properties in the district with an assessed value of more than $600 million. That is up slightly from 2011, which was approximately $2.9 million of revenue based upon uh, $580 million of assessed value. So once again, as Tad said, the evidence shows that relative to maintaining property values and improving the quality of life, property owners are better off in a CID. Since inception, Town Center CID has committed almost, almost $30 million of its revenue to advance its projects for a total of more than $100 million in transportation and infrastructure improvements in the Town Center area CID. 2012 activities and accomplishments. Um, our activities, Town Center area CID act activities are organized into three general areas. One is quality of life enhancements. Two is transportation and uh, public safety, which is about infrastructure, transportation, public safety is about 60% of our expenditures throughout the life of our CID. And third is planning, looking ahead to future projects. Accomplishments in, 12 in 2012 include the completion and opening of the $26 million Big Shanty Road extension which crosses underneath 75 to connects the east side to the west side, provides some relief to traffic on Chastain and Barrett, connects KSU to the mall. Uh, working with this board and others, uh, we changed the name of the proposed Busby Fry connector to the Skip Span connector in honor of the town center CID's first chairman and visionary, the late Skip Span. We had the groundbreaking for Noonday Creek Trail extension, which is the final link of the pedestrian recreational trail, which will now link, when completed, Bell's Ferry all the way through the heart of our district over to Kennesaw Mountain, which already connects over to Marietta. We've uh, completed the SCATS Master Signalization Program, and we've enhanced and maintained landscaping for several miles of right-of-way throughout our district. So looking ahead to 2013, the CID is currently studying and advancing more than $20 million in improvements to increase mobility and improve the quality of life in the town center area, including the skip span connector and the South Barrett Parkway reliever. We're actively working on planning, designing, and pushing forward those concepts. Uh, in 2013, we expect to complete the Noonday Creek Trail, complete the expansion of the intersection of 575 and Barrett Parkway, complete another phase of our signage and wayfinding program, expand our landscape maintenance program, begin our gateway signage, and continue to work closely with the county, uh, ARC, DOT, and others to foster dialogue and advance projects within our CID, which also have a regional benefit like the Northwest Corridor Study. With respect to CID management, we're happy to once again report the Town Center East CID has money in the bank, uh, clean accounting records, tight policies and procedures, sustained and significant board involvement, a low cost of operations, and a great relationship with Cobb County. However, there are still areas for improvement. So in 2013, we'll continue to work on project prioritization, tighter controls on consultant budgets and schedules. We'll continue to improve the scope of our work 
the definition of our deliverables, the definition of achievement of work. We're going to guard against commitment creep. Uh, we're going to be diligent about leveraging our dollars and keeping our operating costs low. So as Tad said, we stand here on behalf of uh, the two CID boards and the businesses that we collectively represent and uh, to say we're proud of our accomplishments in 2012 in both CIDs. As Tad said, they're, they're perfect examples of a public-private partnership where the public and the private sector work together for the greater good of the community. Uh, we're fortunate to be able to, to, to uh, seed our tax dollars, our, our self-directed uh, tax dollars back into our communities and work with you guys to achieve goals that neither one of us could achieve on our own. Um, so we thank you for this opportunity to present once again this year. We thank you for uh, your efforts with us on this journey. And I want to say personally, you know, it's amazing to stand here and think that every person on that on that board and, and Commissioner and County Manager Hankerson too, you guys have all been to one or more of our events in 2012. And for goodness sakes, Joanne and Helen are at every one of our, one of the two of you guys at every one of our meetings every month, in addition to all you guys do. So we appreciate your buy-in, we appreciate your input and your collaboration. And uh, with that, that's our report. you have any questions? Yeah. Thank you, gentlemen, very much. We want to um, echo also on behalf of the citizens of Cobb County how pleased and grateful we are for the relationship and the teamwork. We recognize that a lot of the projects that makes Cobb so great and it's too significant employment centers and economic engines wouldn't exist without your your team your contribution your partnership and to that end we appreciate it you uh, have raised the bar definitely in beautification which I hear about weekly throughout the rest of the county um, but we we appreciate everything you've done to help just make the quality of life so much better for so many people that have no idea that there's a bunch of business people that just decided that they needed to pay more money in to do more improvements to make quality of life and the economic engines in this community stronger and, and better and we as a board recognize it appreciate it i hope the citizens of cobb county recognize what a significant contribution to our success the folks are that participate and uh the, the cooperation is, is is very much appreciated very much appreciated and thank you very much does the board have any other further comments anyone from the board um, I would just like to say we enjoy our partnership with you and attending your meetings and your events. And to date, the Big Shanty Connector grand opening takes the cake. <laughs> thank, thank you so you much, much, gentlemen. Thank, thank you. you. And thank you to the members of the CID's boards and staff that are here tonight. We appreciate that.